it's like 24 hours later. That's all good. Uh, so here we are. We're gonna fight Skeletron. Let me just get some slime balls, though. Thank you. Let's do this. Let us do this. Come back at night if you wish to enter. All right. Well, we gotta wait a little bit longer. But uh, sorry if you hear anything in the background. I am cooking something in the oven. You might hear like a ring or something. A little bit of background noise. I don't know. We'll, 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 you'll hear it. Come on, man. I wish I had a clock on me. I'd figure out what time of day it is. What time of day it was right now. Uh, is there anything else I can use here? Anything else that would make this fight a little bit easier? Ooh, arrows. Possibly jester arrows? I don't know. We do have a good bit of arrows as it is. This is the arrows we should be rocking. Uh, I might use arrows primarily in this fight, to be honest. This seems like a good fight to use arrows on. Can I do it now? Oh, come on. What? Go! Oh! Alright, let's do this. I'm just going for the dome. The dome piece, man. Let's go, bitch. Why is this doing no damage? Alright, let's figure out what does the most damage. Alright, let's do the most damage. Here we go. We're getting like tens off. I do what does the most damage to you? Sir. We're gonna have to kill the hands first. It seems the hands have to go. The hands have to go. I don't do any damage to them. I don't have, uh, what is it? Uh, armor piercing shit, so I can't really do much to them. I mean, this is kind of doing damage. What is that, occasional, like, 19 in there? But let's pull out the arrows. Actually hit his hands. Motherfucker. There we go. These, oh, these vanish on hit. Your hands hurt. Can we, can we talk about the hand. The hand problem here. They hurt when you hit people, alright man? So you need to you need to control your anger in life and use that anger as a different you know, different power. Use it use it somewhere else. It's not on me, please. Stop hitting me. You're hitting me way too often. Get that hand, there we go. So you should start shooting Yeah, skulls now. So let's get rid of this other hand. We got way more than enough time to get rid of both hands and then go for the head. I don't want to farm Skeleton ever again, though, I'll be honest. Oh, he has other No, he killed something else. Oh, hey. No, this is a good time to shoot at him. Well, he's spinning. Wait, why do I... No, I do have to keep clicking. I was wondering, like, do I have to keep clicking this or not? I feel like a lot of things in the game should just be, like, auto-swing, auto-shoot. Unless it's, like, 100% overpowered that something can not like, auto swing on it. But I don't think there is. I don't think there's balancing the pieces of the weapon being auto-swing this game. If something needs to be auto swing and it would be OP for those auto swing, man, just lower the attack speed. Hopefully, that's something they work on in the future. It's just like making a bunch of items auto swing. I don't see too many reasons for things not to auto swing. Does he? Alright, he doesn't shoot in this form. Which means he can go off on him with a fucking musket. That hurt. That hurt, man. Don't ever do that again. Okay. Can I get poison on him? Is that a thing we can do? Poison? Down here. Down here. Down here. Oh, that fucking hurt. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, so what I think I should do in this stage is just run. So close is we gotta you know just hundred percent have a strategy built right now. Or have a plan right now. Just in case we can get low. And then when he gets into this form, this is when I can go off. Put this out. Get a couple more shots in. You gotta dash around right now. My nose is pretty itchy. Okay. Come on. I gotta hit him with one. Anyway. There we go. Maybe I should pull this out. I don't know. What was working the best? I think this was working the best. Alright, well, you're fucking dead. You're dead! We did it! Look at that. Nice and easy. I didn't pick that up. The first thing that I really want to get from the dungeon is called the man hacker. Man of one. Obviously, that's what I want. No, where's the man hacker? There it is. The regular man hacker, which we need dark steel, dark steel alloys from it. Oh my god, look at this. I didn't know you could do that. Uh, and, ooh, that looks sweet. There's probably a couple other weapons I'm already forgetting. Oh no, I know one. We can make this, uh, shotgun. Uh, another, uh, shotgun. Is this shotgun? I don't know what it's called. I think it's called another, it's a blunderbuss. So that's something else I want in here. We need, uh, bones to make that. And also, our next set of armor should be coming here. Let's see what we get from this. 
nothing that I want at all. So let's put everything we don't need away. Seed bag, we don't really need that. No, let's put that away. I'm already wearing a nice helmet. We'll, uh, we'll use some different arrows here. I want to use some arrows in this. Let's put a bunch of shit away. I'll keep the fishing one. Put stuff away that we won't need at this very moment. Actually, no, we'll put that away. Hey, man, how you doing? Get out of here. So rude, man. Get out. All right, let's do this. No, I'll keep that up. Let us do this. Get rid of the platforms. Or at least, maybe instead of getting rid of the platforms, I turn them into wood. And then this one piece, you know, whatever, just put like, on the wall somewhere. Or throw it away. So, let's get water bowl. Oh, there's not water bowl. Oh, there's one there. Let's get this, because it's always nice to sell, I guess. Maybe there's a recipe for something. I don't know. This is a nice start, though. Get in Chill out. Ooh, there's that beep in the background. You guys heard it. This is a good start getting the bone the bone welder. That will help a lot. Peace I mean, not peace candles. Opposite of peace candles. Uh, water candles. Also a good item to get. I have more than enough ammo to just waste here, but I'm going to use my bow. Let's be efficient here, man. It's expert mode. I got a different mentality when playing expert mode, all right? That is to be a conservative and also to a... Uh, do things that are unnecessary and normal that you can that you can do an extra because it makes life easier. But we are looking for some items in here. Uh, a gun would be nice. A handgun would be nice. A cobalt shield would be nice because I can uh, make the fuck was that shield called? There's a version I can make of the I Cthulhu shield. Hey, we need to kill these guys. Uh, what is it? I can do blue shield plus obsidian plus. No wait, hold on, let me think here. I don't know the exact. It's just like an obsidian I can do blue shield combined with a cobalt one. It's really good. Hey, how you doing? Yeah. You are gonna die. If I were to guess. So let me try my best to shield you off from danger. All right, well I tried. Well, thanks for the throwing wrenches. Uh, <laughs> R.I.P. Also, one thing that I'm gonna do while I'm here may be a tedious task for me, but this task will- Oh, dude, look, I got a bone chain. It will save me from, like, annoyance in the future. And that is covering up- That's a stealthy one. That was actually- you have stealth right there. Covering up all these spikes, because I hate spikes. I hate them so much when I come here later on. Or even when I come here, like- In hard mode, they don't really do that much damage to you. But coming here, like, over and over again, like, I feel like we're gonna have to do that to collect things here and there. It's just, they just get really fucking annoying, and I just want to get rid of, get rid of the ones that I always run into, which are the ones that are on the floor. I guess I do run into the ones that are on the wall, a good bit too. but, you know, it's just more convenient. Hey, we got a food all right here. Don't really need it, we got the Fargo's mod, but it's all good. Okay, something else I need to do is upgrade a couple of my uh, accessories, if I can, and also to upgrade my pickaxe and stuff that pickaxe we can make from uh the the harpy shit or not the harpy shit uh aerial light which i think requires harpy feathers to make the item i don't remember but there's a pickaxe and a hammer we can make i do want to make those because why not that would be amazing to have upgrades before we move into you know, the last phase of pre-hard mode and we got an exciting last phase to uh accomplish here so this spawn medusa Fuck no, I'm out of there. I don't like that that's a thing you can do in pre hard mode is spawn in hard mode enemies from statues. It's a cool idea and not a cool idea. Look. How am I supposed to counter that? Okay, I, well, I guess you can't get up there. But uh, that's just rude. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Look how much health she has. What is this? What? <laughs> okay. Uh, we can fight her though. There's no one else here who can fight her. Cause oh no, she made the jump. Uh oh. Uh oh. Go. 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 Handle her. Handle her. Break that trap real quick. Handle her. No. Come on now. I hear peeper coming our way. As long as we don't get hit by her, like 100% fine. Whoa, we spawned in another one. I'm out of here. I don't fucks with no Medusa. Let's try and get them to despawn. Alright, the despawn. I gotta get- Oh no! Fuck! Alright, statue's gone. 
It is now a part of my statue collection. Hey, I've been looking for you guys. Right, you, singular guy, Dark Steel Knight. Let's get these cores. I'm really interested to, interested to uh, see what the Man Hacker can do. Sounds like it's gonna be a fun weapon. Like man hacker, does that not sound fun? That sounds brutal now that I think about it. But there's a there's a evil fun to it. It sounds like there's an evil fun to it. It better be a great weapon. This is pretty pretty far in uh, to get a weapon. At least an extra or this shit is really far in. I feel like I can do I can do this in like the third episode of a normal normal character playthrough. Ow! That's fucking that's that's fucked up. Alright, we got an interesting enemy here from Tremor. Let's uh, heal up. Oh god. I'm walking into more and more traps. I wanna go fight the cool looking enemy. It's from Tremor. I barely see him. Oh dude, a key? That might be more important than cool looking enemy. I want the key now. Oh, well, he's still over there. I think he's leaving anytime soon. Okay, this is a problem. Another key? Not a problem. Big dungeon keeper. Alright, this is a dungeon keeper. You look cool though. I'll give you that, man. You look really cool. I don't like that that's just coming out of nowhere. Where the hell is that? Oh god. Move, move. Get out of the way. Okay. Hey, keeper. Kill this dude real quick. Okay. Oh, god. Handle me. Handle me. Handle me. I'm missing. Too much missing. Okay. What? How did I not break the fucking water bowl? So I would open up the chest in here, but usually what I do, I don't know if I've done it recently, I'm playing this. But usually what I do is uh go back to whatever chest I didn't open, and I open that, and then we progress forward like that. That's usually what I do. Get out of here. All right, let's uh drink these invisibility potions. Yeah. Fuck this boy. I don't know why you'd want to be invisible. Ever. Stop. Five damage, just five damage too much. There's too many enemies. Is there a water candle somewhere? There's no water candle anywhere. I have to go for the piercing. That whole fucking army piercing. Army piercing, that's not weird. Battalion? Would that sound better? Battalion piercing. No, it doesn't sound better. Let me get some of these bricks though. I gotta cover up some spikes. These are getting fucking annoying. Get out of here, everybody get out of here. Oh my god. Alright, we picked up some uh some gear here. We got high tide stream sting. Now from what I know from the stream sting, it is actually a really fast shooting bow, I'm pretty sure. So this is actually really nice. Let's let's put out some use into it here. Uh what can we oh, I'll use on you. Look at that, holy hell. That is awesome. I love the speed on it. Hey you, where are you going? I need to kill you. Very sorry that you are our priority, but it just happened, man. I'm an archer. Well, not an archer. I'm a ranged character. And uh, you are on that list of items needed to help out being a ranged character. He's dead already. I don't know why I'm still talking to him. Alright, I gotta clear some of this shit out. No! I don't wanna use the. Get out of here! Holy hell. You got a lot of help, man. Get out of here! It feels so weird to have so many keys. This is like the first time I had a decent amount of keys on deck. Hey, can you not be underground to where I can't hit you, asshole? You know how hard you're making my life right now? Get him quick! Yeah, there we go. Got it, then. Any thanks. Any gave us a high tide. Thanks, though, for that magic weapon. Yo, I'm getting a lot of duty here. Them expert mode drop rates, though. Where is this chest we're looking for? I gotta find this chest we're looking for. Cause there's one somewhat far back. Oh, right up here. Right up here where the Medusa was. Boom. There we go. Shield. That's what I wanted. Nice. Oh, shit. I don't got anywhere to put it. Ropes? Why am I carrying around ropes? That's the real question there. Alright, let's put these statues away. That is nice to do. And then let's throw that away. Alright. Pretty good stuff so far. We got one of the items that I wanted. Now all I really want to get is a gun. And maybe a couple more dark steel cores and probably a couple more uh, bones. Probably need a good bit of bones to make the necro armor if I make it. All right, five keys and there's a lot of chests over here, so let's pop these open. See what we get. Yeah, there we go, gun. That is what I've been looking for. Nice to see that we got it. 
Alright, what else do I need? Ooh, there's a bunch of more chests here. That's pretty much all I need when it comes to the ranger part. I'm sorry. Fuck off! So many enemies! Holy shit! Did I like accidentally turn up the spawn rate? Hold on, I gotta check. I might have accidentally turned up the spawn rate to fucking cheat sheet or something. Can we? Can we slow? Kill. Ooh, I guess I can't check now. Alright, I can check now. Let's see. Nope, it's at one. Holy fuck, I was just naturally getting a lot of spawn rates. Maybe there's a blue candle effect every once in a while. That was a fuck ton of enemies. Hey, good thing about that. I gotta walk back here eventually. That's the good thing. Okay. That's a uh, quick stack stuff. Accessories, uh, ball and chain thrown in there. What else we throw in there? Another ball and chain. Nazar. Nazar. Uh, what else? That looks pretty good. Hello, I heard an item. I heard something fall from the sky. I think it was a star. What do we get from this? Oh. Azure Great Bow. That can actually be pretty good. Alright, let's look into some stuff here. Starting with. St starting with. I don't know what we're gonna start with. There's something I wanted to do and just left mine. Oh, there it is. It came back into my mind. Hello. Hey, you. Check this out. Look at this. Hemorrhage and Eternal Night. Ooh, Lifesteal would be pretty goddamn nice to have as a ranger. So I might have to. Maybe I'll make both. We'll see. We'll see how hard it is to make both, but I gotta make a Molten Fury either way. Let's talk to him about guns. Why would I ever want to make a Boomstick Phoenix Blaster? I might make one, I don't know. Probably not, to be honest. Because, like I said a couple of times throughout the playthrough, I want to focus on modded weapons a lot of the time. And that's why I don't get too much vanilla stuff. Maybe vanilla armor here and there, maybe a vanilla weapon here and there. But priorities is around... Priorities are around... Uh, modded stuff. But let's take a look at the shield. This is what I want to make. So we need an obsidian skull. And from there we can go. Alright, do I have a Medusa statue? Does not look like I have a Medusa. Do I have a pillar statue? Do not have a pillar statue. So how far is it? Just a single block away. So I do that. And uh, for now we'll have a placeholder. So I can get this statue out of my inventory. Hey, look at this big ass house. I showed that off already, didn't I? Ooh, there's a star. I never want to miss out on stars anymore. Made that a goal like an episode or two ago. Get the fuck out of here. You guys don't respect these candles. Okay. Obsidian. I don't know if I can make obsidian right now. Make the obsidian thing I need. No, I can't. Alright, so we'll do that in a second. But uh, I'll be right back. I gotta go like eat my food. I guess I can make this a longer episode. I'm bringing you guys with me. I don't know if I said I was going to do this off camera or not. But I'll bring you with me. I guess, yeah, we can take this path down to obsidian. Hey, might as well mine aerial light on the way down because we'll be needing it to make the uh, upgrades or pickaxe and hammer upgrades. Okay, see, I lied. This didn't lead down here. I mean, we might be able to find a branching path eventually. Hey, we need this stuff. Hold up. I'll reorganize. Oh, shit. I didn't even clear my part. Uh, I'll reorganize my weapons and stuff. Change a couple here and there. But until then, let's do this. Make a bunch of bombs. Now, I could just walk around. That would be the easy way. But why would I do that, man? That sounds too easy. That sounds too damn easy to just walk around. You can't always have that happen in life. You can't just walk around things in life. That's definitely not how life works. I'll break that. I'm scared about that. Okay. Just trying to get some area light. Maintain our bombage here. Might as well light up areas. Light up right here. There we go. Are we down yet? This should get us down to where I want to go. A little bit of extra water here and there. Hello. Crystal biome. My favorite biome. Okay. Let's find this lava. It's not too far down from where we are now. So we should be fine. Fuck you, dark trap. So. The crystal biome. I've been told by the developer of the crystal biome, crystal mod, that uh, I asked him when I should fight the boss for that mod. He said hold out for a little bit. Uh, I think he said like post planter. I, I don't remember actually. But he said hold out for a bit. The boss is getting a pretty big upgrade when it comes to his challenge and stuff and how it works. So I will be holding out on that boss in the uh, 
Play on the Mario Play 2. Let's kill this guy. Granite monster. Alright. We gotta go through the granite mine. Ooh, wait. We're getting granite here. Of course, I do want this. I'm gonna burp. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna look at it. Night Owl Potion. Activate. Get the fuck out of here, dude. You want to fuck up? Yeah, I'm getting these cores because we can make a. Uh, what am I getting here, about? We can make a. Uh, shit, I can't focus. Hold up, let me tell you. We can make a. A repeater? Repeater's a pretty goddamn OP, man. Shoot really fast. It's a repeat. What's better than the repeater? Not repeater. That's not even close to the repeater. Where is this level? We're close. We made it out of the crystal. Now we should be like nearly here at the lava. Oh, it's around. We gotta go around. We go this way to it. No problem. We can listen to that bumping music again. Okay. Mushroom seeds on deck. I will need those. We'll keep this. Modded ranger, of course. We need mushrooms. Okay, just my shell I wanna pick up. Look. Bitch. Okay. Hello, lava. Lava guardian. By the four guardians here. Get out of here, man. Right, hold up. Hold up. Looking for there we go. Obsidian. Boom bada bing. We got the obsidian on deck. How much do I need for a skull? Let's look that up right now. Skull. Whoa, time out, time out. Drink a baby potion. Alright, 20. 20 might as well get extra though. I can do it this way. That's the way I'm gonna do it, man. Quicker. More efficient this way. Am I right? I'm using our precious bombs. This is see. Okay, let's start with this here. Making the obsidian Thulu, whatever shield. Uh, obsidian skull, where do we make that at? Just at a table, right? Somewhere. There it is, boom. Obsidian skull, that's on deck. Obsidian shield, that's on deck. And now, obsidian shield with the... I have Cthulhu one, bam! Arcane Obsidian, I Obsidian uh, Arcane. So we're gonna reforge that. Boop. Oh, come on, give me defense. I want defense. 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 How much is it costing? Not that much at all. Defense. Defense. Give me fucking defense! Alright, no, menacing is actually pretty goddamn good. So we'll, we'll, we'll stick with menacing. Uh, what else do I need to do here? Is there anything else to stack? Stack away probably these mushroom grass seeds I should put away for now. So they're gonna be pretty damn useful. Uh, the witching table. Let's just put this here. What else? What else? What else? The man hacker. There we go. That's what we need to do. Do I have chains just chilling around? No, I don't. So let's make a couple of these. Boom. And then I need smooth coal. And from here, we should be able to craft the uh, ingots. I don't see them though. Then I'm just going blind all of a sudden. My eyesight! Alright, hold up. Dang it. Alloy. Alloy, that's what it's called. I'm gonna sneeze. Wait, wait. No, we're good. Alright. Anvil, that's all we need. So, if I just open this chest up, we should be able to make these alloys. I'm actually not sure we needed the man hacker. I mean, I'm pretty sure we didn't need the dark steel cores now that I really think about it. That might have not been uh, something we needed. Saw blade. We do need saw blades. First, let's start with a man hacker. That would be a nice stepping stone. Let's start from the bot. Oh, here we go. Slugger. That's also what I wanted. That's something I really wanted. Because I hear that's really OP. And it would be nice to get a little OP for this upcoming boss fight. Or at least somewhat OP. So what do we need for the man hacker? Man hack. Man hack. Man hacker. What's the hacker? Okay. Man hacker. 
any silver bar. So we need tungsten or we need silver. We got more than enough tungsten here. So I'm just not looking carefully enough. And this time I will look carefully enough. I don't see anything there. I don't see it. I think I'm going crazy. Is tungsten the equivalent of silver? I'm pretty sure it is. Am I going crazy? Ah, that's where I was going crazy. It's eight. Eight. I thought that was six the whole time. Okay. Don't yell at me too quickly. Give me a bit. There we go. Ooh, look at that. Perfectly eight. And I can make the dark steel crossbow. Uh, man hacker on deck. So we need saw blades now too. So what else do I need for that? Oh, I need fucking coal. God damn it. There's a lot of stuff we need to get. And I don't really like that because I feel like I'm going all over the place right now. All right. Let's let's start off here. Stop talking. Let's put this in here. This in here. Let's make the slugger. So what do we need to make the slugger? Probably just need to open up in here. And scroll down to the bottom. There it is. Slugger. Uh, has an incredibly high recoil which sends you backwards. Boom. Slugger's on deck. This is going to replace the Buccaneer's blunderbuss. Ooh, I like that knockback. It's hella gun is strong. Alright, it doesn't have like the crazy spread as the Buccaneers one. But, you know, we gotta slowly upgrade our weapons over time. So, there we go, there's that. Uh, Superior Shade Thrower. We're putting this in here. No longer of use to us. We'll be replacing that with the Man Hacker. And the Bramble Shot. We are replacing that, sadly. But, no, don't replace that. We're gonna replace it with the Stream, stream Sting for now. Uh, these two I'll keep. Oh, I didn't need to upgrade the shotgun yet. Actually, I might get rid of the snow shotgun. I don't know. I feel like I should get rid of it. If we get another, like, really unique weapon, I'll get rid of it. But, uh, let me do some inventory management right quick, and I'll meet you guys in a second. We'll go mine aerial light and try and upgrade our stuff, and we'll end off the episode from there. Alright, first thing we can make here. I don't exactly even know what the shit is called. Actually, might as well give it to the guide, because that'll probably be easier than just trying to figure out what the name of the pickaxe is. Oh my god, look at all this beautiful shit we can make. Gal Force! That's pretty sweet. Uh, let's take a look, though. Where is it? So we're gonna make the Aerial Ham Axe. And then the Sky Fringe Pickaxe. Let's do Pickaxe first. Because I feel like having the Pickaxe first will help us mine more. Where the fuck is the Sky Mill? Why am I all the way over here looking for a Sky Mill? Crazy game readers. He's a crazy dude. Thank you. Alright, let's uh boom. 95% pickaxe power. Yeah, that does indeed overpower ours. Plus we get a speed bump on it. Hell yeah, you you're going bye bye, pickaxe of the blue. I'm very sorry for our short relationship, but you gotta go, man. I'm moving on to bigger and better things. I don't mean to just drop you like that. But it has to happen. Alright, I gotta go find more of this stuff. It's low-key hard to find. Low-key. I don't know where the easiest place would be to find it, but I'm gonna head to the left. Alright, this is very odd that there is a um, meteor kind of like in the fucking ground. Oh, I guess there's a hole that leads to this meteor. Look at that. Hold up here. This is really where this meteor is? Holy hell. This is an odd place for a meteor. Hey, how you doing, meteor? Thanks for chunking me. Hey. Chill out, man. I'm just here for some aerial light. Y'all got aerial light. Hey, here we go. Exactly what I was looking for. We're gonna get like mobbed by me. That'd be terrible. So let's get the rest of this. We shouldn't need too much of it to make the uh, ham axe. So let's see how much how much more there is. Yeah, there's a good bit down here. Oh, harpy statue. I might be able to make use of that if I don't have one already. I feel like I have one already. Get the hell out of here. Alright. Area light. Alright. Boom. Ham axe on deck. Savage. Watch out, guys. This ham axe is savage. And there we go. We can give her our axe and our hammer. Or our mallet, I guess. And that will end off this episode. We made some good prop. Motherfucker. I gotta stop the cooking that one. I always do that. We made some good progress here. Maybe we didn't get to show off all the new weapons we got. But uh, I gotta slowly use all of them. We should be... Either next episode is going to be more preparation for the main antagonist of the series. Or we're just going to get right to it. And that is the Star Scouter. We got to fight him eventually. Actually, one more thing, dude, before I go. Let's look at the Necro Armor right quick. Where is this Necro Armor? 
Beast Necro Armor. There it is. Uh, five defense. Four defense. Five percent increased damage. So this is probably a better upgrade here. Yeah. I mean, we got Fire Mist here. That's pretty cool. I think I might just go for the Necro Armor. I don't ever remember the Necro Armor's passive. Like, who does? Do you guys remember it? Probably something about, like, ammo consumption. I never remember it. I don't use the Necro Armor ever. These are ones that are rain-flaked way, way back. But uh, that's gonna end off this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it.